Hey now, what's happening? I have another uh, electronic tutorial video here. Well, actually, it's, it's a second electronic tutorial video here. And this tutorial is dealing with the breadboard. So now if I was teaching uh, cooking, it would be a different type of breadboard. But since I'm sticking to electronics for now, here is the breadboard. So basically what the breadboard is, is a, it's a series of uh, rows and columns that you could plug uh, components into. Mind that, that uh, burn a hole right there. That, that could sometimes happen when things go awry. But uh, essentially the breadboard is for testing. There's a few different other types of boards. So like I said, the breadboard's for testing. There's other types of boards that include the perforated board. And it's just perforated because it has like a bunch of holes in it. So on one side, it'll have just uh, a, a blank surface. Mind you, this one's not not so blank. And on the other side, it'll have copper um, pores or pores that have copper filled in them. And basically what that allows you to do is this is would be a more permanent version of your circuit. Where So the breadboard would be... Uh, when you go and test your design to make sure that it actually works. So you could easily uh, plug in and, re and remove components. And then your uh, perforated board would be for actually soldering your circuit in place and, and having it somewhat final. Or semi-final, I guess, because the next board is actually a PCB or printed circuit board. And this one here is actually a homemade PCB that I made. Uh, it was for a project that I was working on that I didn't really get around to finishing. So it has a few buttons on it and it has a, a socket for a, for a chip here. It's actually an Arduino chip. Uh, but you can see here this one, it has the copper filled in. And there's a few, it's double sided PCB which just basically means there's a circuit on two sides. So you can see a lot of the traces and stuff. So. I'll eventually make a tutorial about how to make homemade PCBs. But let's move on to the focus of this video, which is the breadboard. 